everyone and welcome to discovery time if you love ladybugs raise your hand if you love ladybugs nod your head if you love ladybugs say yes 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 if you love ladybugs fly 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 boys and girls i love ladybugs I love ladybugs because they're so small and cute. Do you know who else loves ladybugs? Gardeners and farmers love ladybugs. They love ladybugs because the ladybugs eat other bugs that eat the gardeners and farmers plants. Today, we are going to be making a ladybug crown. But before we make our crown, Let's take a closer look at a ladybug. A ladybug is also known as a ladybird beetle. The ladybug has six legs. It has seven black spots. It has two red hard wings. It has one head, two eyes two antennas. These are the materials that we will be using today. A round lid. We're going to trace the lid for our ladybug head. A pair of scissors. Some glue. Some tape. A black and a white crayon. If you don't have crayons, that's okay. You can use markers or you can use colored pencils a ruler, a half sheet of black paper, and a sheet of red paper. So let's start with our headband. So our headband is gonna be two inches wide. So with our ruler, let's find the two inch point, just right there, right where my finger is. And we are going to mark our paper. We're going to mark the short side of our paper. Okay, the short side. So we're going to line up the ruler, the end, find the number two. And then with our crayon, we're going to make a little dot where that number two is. Then we're going to do the same thing on the bottom of our paper. Line it up. Find the two, make a little dot. Now what we're gonna do is with our ruler, we're gonna connect the two dots and then we're gonna make a line all the way down. This might be a little hard for some of us, so if you need a grown up to help you, that is okay. So with our scissors, we're going to cut out the strip that we just drew. So now we have one strip for our headband. And we're going to do the same thing. We're going to measure again. Line that ruler right up to the edge. And with your black crayon, make a little dot. And then we're going to do the same thing on the bottom again. Okay. There we go. And then we're going to connect the two dots with a line using the side of our ruler. Okay, let's go ahead and cut that strip out. All right, now we have our second strip. So what we're going to do is we're going to tape the two strips together. Okay. 
there we go. We have our headband. So now what we want to do is we're going to decorate it with some spots. So with our black crayon, we're going to add spots to our red headband. The ladybug that we just looked at had seven spots. All right, I am done adding spots. Let's make our ladybug head. We're going to use our black paper and our round lid. We're going to put that right on top of our black paper. And with our white crayon, we're going to draw or trace the circle. just like that. Now it's time to cut out our ladybug head. Okay, there's our ladybug head. Our ladybug had two antennas. So let's go ahead and cut out our antennas. Our antennas are gonna be half an inch wide. So it's the middle of the beginning point and the one right where my finger is. So line up your ruler with the edge of your paper and with your white crayon measure half of an inch at the top and then again at the bottom connect those dots make a line and cut There's one antenna, and we're going to do the same thing again. Find your half inch mark. Make a little dot at the top, and then again at the bottom. Connect those dots. Make a line and cut. Okay, with our glue stick, we are going to glue our antennas to our head. There we go, our two antennas on our ladybug head. So our ladybug has two eyes. With your white crayon, we're gonna draw two eyes, two circles for our eyes. And we're gonna color them in. Now my ladybug is gonna have a happy face. So after my two eyes, I'm going to draw a happy face on my ladybug. Okay, there's my ladybug head. So now what we're going to do, we're going to get our headband. And we're going to glue our ladybug head to our headband. So we're going to add some glue. You don't want to add glue to the whole back of the head, just to the bottom part, just 
like that, just to the bottom part so that we can glue it to our headband. And we can wear it right away. If we glue the whole thing, then we can't wear it right away. There you go. Just like that. Now we measure and tape. And then we're just gonna tape it around. After you've measured, we're gonna tape. There we go, boys and girls, our ladybug crown. I'm gonna try mine on. Does everyone have their ladybug crown on? Okay, let's flap our wings like a ladybug. I have a little ladybug, ladybug, ladybug. I have a little ladybug. Its wings are black and red. See the little ladybug, ladybug, ladybug. See the little ladybug. It's flying here and there. Now it's landing on the ground, on the ground, on the ground. Now it's landing on the ground and crawling here and there. Thank you, boys and girls, for joining me today. I hope you had fun. Make sure to share your ladybug crown with me right here at this link right here. <laughs> okay, boys and girls, I will see you next time. Bye. Thank you for watching our virtual Purple Museums broadcast. If you're enjoying this content, please consider making a donation to support our efforts. Our broadcasts are every Tuesday and Thursday on Facebook and YouTube. Visit us online and in person. Bill's Backyard, the museum's outdoor educational space, is open every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Stay in the loop by joining our email list. Visit www.cdm.org for more information.